Lambda Days is a conference on functional programming and emerging technologies. This year we have six tracks, uh, we have over 40 speakers and almost 400 people coming to network and learn and just participating in this event. So the atmosphere is great, people are happy, I think. And we have attendees from not only from Poland, but from all over Europe and US. So this is also a great way to actually connect with the rest of the world. Well, what I really liked was the first day of the conference that had many talks on the philosophical side of programming and the philosophical side or, and also historical side of functional programming, which is really nice and I think it's important to keep this in mind that uh, we are not just coding, there is a lot of context behind it and to know where all the concepts come from. It's a combination of things that I've never heard about, the stuff that I don't know that I find really, really, really exciting. And of course, you know, this morning's keynote with Lambda Calculus to the rescue, uh, a Twitter moment that was particularly exciting. So I think anyone who wants to challenge what they know and find out things that they don't know should attend. Functional programming languages aren't arbitrary. They weren't invented out of nothing. They were rediscovered many times. I had a lot to do with the development of Haskell, so that's my favorite, but there are lots of other interesting functional languages out there over quite a wide range, including Racket and um, OCaml and F-sharp, um, Scala. There's interesting things going on with Clojure. There are a huge number of interesting languages where interesting things are happening. Elm is one of the most recent. They keep popping up. I think it's good um, from my point of personal point of view to hear things which aren't Alec. Honestly, to, to, to hear other parts of the other parts, talk from other parts of the functional world and hear what they're doing and why they're doing it and how they're doing it and things like this and what they look like. I find that very, it's very interesting just to see, to see what's going on, um, how does it affect what I'm doing, what I'm working with, and it's interesting like this. How can we interact, for example, between things? Two of the highlights are some talks I saw today. Uh, the first one was by Pierre and by Claudia. They were talking about embedded systems using functional languages, partially Erlang and partially Elm in embedded systems doing that. And the second one was an F-sharp talk by Evelina um, describing using F-sharp to get information out of the Star Wars um, world of the communication, the peoples in there and how they interact with each other and things like this from it. And I found both very interesting because they're, they're different from what I normally do. And that's, that's why I think one of the strong things about this, this conference is because there are a lot of different, different talks going on about different problems, different languages and so on. And London Days is a really fun conference. It's really nice to meet with other people that work on programming languages that are functional. It's, it's really fun and it's super exciting to see that the functional community is growing. There's lots of conferences, lots of languages, lots of libraries. It's really, it's really happening. The conference has been very successful and we are happy to have all those people coming to Lambda Days and spending those two days with us. And we hope to organize even bigger and better events in 2017.